HRCT uses a narrow beam collimation to make thin slices of the lung parenchyma in axial sections with high-resolution reformation. During COVID-19, in the setting of pneumonia, the presence of ground glass opacities is a very useful diagnostic clue. These are multifocal nodular opacities predominantly seen in subpleural locations. After four to eight days, you could also notice a crazy paving pattern. These are the same opacities with superimposed interlobular and intralobular thickening. What else could you look for? Other findings could be regarding mediastinal lymphadenopathy, description of the hilum, whether trachea or the major bronchi are normal or not, and assessment of both the pleury especially for any signs of effusion. You will also find description about the ribcage, cardia, and esophagus in your report. And now the most important thing, your CT severity score. Note that our lungs consist of five lobes, and thin walls of tissue called fissures separate the different lobes. The right lung is divided into upper, middle, and lower lobe by horizontal and oblique fissure, while the human left lung has two lobes, upper and lower, divided by an oblique fissure. Each lobe is graded with a score of 1 to 5 according to the degree of infection, so a maximum total of 25 for all the five lobes. The lobe is graded 1 if there's less than 5% infection. If the infected part is about 5 to 25% of the total lobe, the score is 2. When 26 to 49% is the affected area, then 3 out of 5, 50 to 75% infected lungs, are 4. While the most dangerous, when there's infection beyond 75%, the score is a 5 out of 5. Now in the same way, all the five lobes are graded, and you get a final severity score, out of 25. If the final score is up to 8, it's mild and has the best prognosis. Severity score ranging from 9 to 15, is of moderate severity, but when it crosses 15, it's severe, and quite alarming. For instance look at this report, the patient had a severity score of 12, which is moderate, but here in this case, the patient is severe with a score of 24. Lastly in your report, you'll find Corrid's score. It's a standardized reporting system based on level of suspicion of COVID-19, which is graded from very low, that is Corrid's 1, to very high, Corrid's 5. Both the reports were of patients with Corrid's 5, with typical findings of COVID-19, as you can see peripheral bilateral ground glass opacities. You could also see reverse halo signs or other findings of organizing pneumonia. This test would cost you around 5,000 Indian rupees.